Okay, we're here looking for special rocks, and um, Steph and Andrew are already looking. These these rocks have fossils in them. Stefan, show me a rock. Here. Well, this is it's shale. Really delicate. This is shale, and it's it's uh, mud and leaves and everything else all pressed down long, long time ago when the dinosaurs were here. And it's really, really delicate. And every once in a while, when you look inside you'll see a pattern of a leaf that got pressed in the mud. Okay. Have you guys found any fossils yet? No. Nope. Right. Here's an example of some of the patterns that you get in these things. Some people think that wherever you find this kind of uh, oil stone that there's oil underneath. But it's impervious to water because they put it on the roads to keep the roads from getting muddy. Which one's that, Andrew? You think it's part of a tree? Okay, let's see. Hey, Andrew wants me to show you this. Hard as a rock. Oh! Straight lines. This looks like a. This is some sort of a, a fossilized something. You can see it's a round circular you can pattern slow down. in the rock. Hang on to the rock, you can slide I down. See, it's, it's got a definite contour to it, and, and the texture is different. Mm. This? You can see it on this Probably angle, it's really show. clear. This looks like a shoe. Yeah, it could. It looks like almost like a round type of shell, or maybe a piece of a tree, a fossilized tree. The piece that Andrew's given me. It's a uh, bright yellow, and it's got black lines along the edge of it. So it, the texture is totally different than what, everything else that's uh, around here. That looks like something squashed on the edge of it there, that black piece. This piece here is very, very light and very, very charred. Uh, it Lisa? looks almost like a fossilized piece of burnt tree stump. You can almost see the rings of the tree in it as you break it apart. But the color of this... It's it's yeah. an amber color. This one is an amber color. You can't card this. And it's solid. One. There's there's no graininess to this at all. It's just a solid chunk. Hey daddy. Help! Here comes a slide. Stefan's running for his life. <laughs> you hear um Did I do that? I think so. Well, I don't this. think so. This is the one that Isha found. You okay, Stefan? Just a minute, Andrew. I knew that thing was gonna happen. You okay, Stefan? You should be careful for those slides. You know what he was doing? He was throwing rocks at the thing. Were you trying to start the slide? Nope. Yes. No. I like breaking the rocks. It's so easy to, but you think well, this could have been a bug? Let's see. 
Look just right that, oh, that um, little leg thing, thing you see? It looks just like a little bird. Ooh, somebody break this paper. It does look like a bird, doesn't it? It looks like. Now from here, we're going to see if we can see the layering in the rock. Now, this is the, at, from the top, it's pretty much steady until you get to a white line. You could probably see the white line running through the middle of the screen right now. And that white line actually looks like a white line of ash. Now, I'm going to climb up and have a closer look at that white line. But you can see the layering in the hill. There's a lot of different colors. When the light is right, you can see all the different colors from different periods of deposit. It looks like thousands of lines of different colors drawn horizontally across the cliff. A line that runs through the cliff should be running right through the middle of the screen here. Now we're trying to find somebody who can go up. I'm not there. big rock slide. Right yeah. on there. I'd like to know what that white line is. I need somebody to climb up and see what that white line is I up there. Climb? Look at this. Last Dad. person who climbed. Such rocks are in my shoes. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> They're still not empty. But you get a lot of rocks in your shoes when you do it. I'll, go, I'll rock, climb up rock. for you. Okay, here's a rock that Alicia's just found. Completely gray all around, about the size of a pierogi, and orange on the inside. Like a pierogi. Like a pierogi. And get a good picture of this. White deposits. them look like this with the layers, different layers. Center of it all, here's one that looks just like a fine light brown powder. You can just break it up, you can see the powder, it's like a kind of puff ball or something. See anything up there, Alicia? Now we weren't able to get up to the white line high on the hill, but at the bottom, mixed in with all the other debris, were some pieces of white, looked like uh, white lava rock, almost, uh, almost like ash or lava rock, and that's probably from that white line. And it's hard, very hard, very brittle, and uh, looks, looks just like lava, white lava rock that it's some sort of volcanic ash that has been uh, pressed to make it hard and chunky. It, it may have started out as a powder and ended up in chunks, but it could easily be ground back into a powder with a little bit of pressure. Here's Alicia's pet rabbit.
level of the lake is quite high this year and the boat couldn't be pulled out far enough uh, to prevent the water from getting into the boat so the boys are going to bail some of the water out of the back of the boat and we're going to see if we can get it floating again. Andrew, you can get right in the boat if you like to get that water out. No! Take it in the boat and take it out. Okay, we'll get in the boat. Okay. It'll be easier to do if you get in the boat. There's about a hundred pails of water that have to come out. I can't even reach it. Uh, Stefan, you dump it on the other side so you don't get Andrew's clothes wet. Okay. I'll dump it on the other side. Okay, Andrew. I need to get in. Somebody help me in. Daddy, can you hold my tail on the other side and kind of don't get in? Okay. Andrew, you're going to get in too? No. Probably easier to do it from inside the boat. Can you get in, I Andrew? Can get in. Can you help me in, Daddy? Yep. Stephanie, it looks like you're about half done there now. Very long set of steps up to the cabin. Daddy, you have to, Daddy, you have to About 150 you feet to straight up. Hey, Stephanie. Types of birds feeding just off the end of the dock here. A couple of gulls. No, he's not wet. He's just trying to get the water out of the boat. <laughs> Andrew fell down and he scraped, scraped his shin. Check his leg to see if he's okay. We're going to go up. And we're going to get some life jackets and a worm and a, and a worm and some gasoline for the boat and a fishing thing <laughs> a fishing rod what else do we need hats know. we need hats so we don't get sunburns yeah. right and um, and make sure the boat won't fall in the water <laughs> make sure that the camera doesn't fall in the water There goes the big tire. Hey, Andrew! Hi, Andrew! Hi, Stefan! Hi, Alicia. Coke, Stephen. I'm drinking Coke, and <laughs> I because that's his award, award for um, running one um, one kilometer 
um, as fast as the car went from the beach to the cabin. Yeah, he ran all the way. So, so Dad gave him a glass of coke. Uh, why did you want to run all the way, Stefan? Uh, because I didn't want to waste time walking. So I ran, and I. And <laughs> I said, well, I yeah, that's that's funny. Car, that's so. funny. Nice joke. It's not supposed to be one. No, it's like you said. You said I'm, I didn't run because. Uh, because I, I wasn't the one who Then why didn't you come in the car with us? Well, because... Then you get out of the way. <laughs> because I wanted to side. That's why, right? Yeah. And, and I get out of there. I, well, you I got coke, no fear. <laughs> well, I can run as fast as the car, so I... Um, the car was going slow, you know. You know what? I farted on the way. Maybe, we, maybe um, later we, I can tape you running and see how much, how far you running. I didn't tape you. We're just interviewing you, okay? So how do you feel about running all the way? You like it? Good. You gonna do it again? I might. <laughs> hey, yummy pop. Yeah. Well, I, I gotta get go get my own pop, okay? Okay. So, bye. Daddy is trying to put the barbecue on and um yeah, I'm gonna he, blow myself up. Yeah, he's gonna he's having a little trouble with it. Because it's too windy today. Yeah, it is. So here we go, I'm gonna light the fire. Yep, and see what okay. happens. Oh, that didn't work. Yeah it didn't. It's so windy the match blows up right away. Yeah, I thought so. Oh, that didn't work. Oh no. This could take some time. I know it could. That didn't work. Oh. oh. I think your dad taught me to hold that for that cover. So hey, watch out. Um. What's happening, Daddy? What's going to happen? What? Are you going again? Oh, you're having trouble with that. Did it blow out again? Why would it blow out inside the bar? It's going now. I don't want to blow out. Your father had a board set. Yeah, it's going good now. Okay. Okay, now I'm going to put these sausages on. Huh? Daddy, I'd like to the button, but it still says record. Okay, we'll push it again then. Oh, okay. Okay, where is it? Okay. Ready? To put it on? It's on now. Everything's going. Good. When's it going to be ready? When is it going to be ready, Daddy? When? When's it going to be ready, Dad? Well, it's going to take a while, Stephanie. Quite a while? Yeah. There. That should be good for a while. Okay. We have a groundhog. I think he's a groundhog. There he goes. Is he looking? He's eating supper, but he must like the sun too. Do it on zoom up close. I am. There's his hole. Oh no. We'll have to move the car up a little. It's the hole that he went into. Yeah. He went on to the one on the right. Cue. 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 Fish. 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 No fish. Alicia.
for the cows. This is called Aaron Park in Killarney. Yeah. And it's kind of a chilly day and the kids are just about to try My it. daddy bring this tree for just peanuts. about to try the water. I'm not. What? Have you got all your suntan lotion on now? Yes. Good. You're having a hard time getting in the water. It's not exactly a warm day. Well, Andrew doesn't seem to be impressed. Leisha's in. There's stuff and playing in the sand. Okay, Stefan. I'm going to go back now. Okay, Stefan. What? Just go across one more time. Okay, here he comes. Okay. Okay. That's it. There. Shut.
cord that you can see them all right. I think that's an abandoned ant's nest. But uh, and that's why they stopped. They might be deciding whether to stay there or not. Who's deciding? They're just well, the chief ant. Walking all over the place. What are they this doing? This one found a uh, larvae of an ant. Let me see. It's got. Uh, see that thing in its mouth? Looks like a rice kernel. I uh, found a larvae. Yeah. It's. Yeah. They found another ant's nest. Is oh, what yeah, they've I done. See. It. see? They're going into, there's the door. I see, see the door. I see an ant with something. Yeah, see there's the door. They're raiding it. They're taking over. Believe it or not, they're heading back. They're starting mm -hmm. to go back. What do you mean they're going back? Maybe the other well, ants are taking. They're taking little... Uh, they're having a war. The huh? little white there's things that they're carrying. Yeah, those are the yeah. ant larvae. That, do you know what ant, ant, ant larvae are? Maybe uh, ants. Yeah. They look like they're stealing something. Yeah, I they're stealing those well, white where things. Were the, I don't know if they're stealing them or if they actually belong to them. Going in and coming out with the white things. Those are baby ants in sacks. Whoa! Well, they're all going back now. Immature, I they're know, baby ants neat. inside sacks, Sander. Inside what? Time to see one of the miracles of nature. Ants are intelligent creatures. Ants are intelligent creatures. Ants are intelligent creatures. Alicia? There. What? I'm taking a picture of you. Boys have decided to try their hand at fishing. It's a beautiful, warm, quiet night at the lake. Calvin just caught a catfish that got away. Said it was a real thrill. And it was that long. <sighs> now he's going to build a bridge to the raft. Oh, there's a nail sticking out at the end. That'll never do. I'll have to put it back with the nail sticking. Lots of fish out, fishermen out tonight. I don't know what he's planning to do here, but... For a while here, we had a bunch of really tiny fish jumping out of the water. And we figured there must be bigger fish following them, so that's where Calvin decided to do some fishing. Was pretty surprised, except we didn't have a net. Out. Great cast, Stefan. There was a catfish, Daddy. I I mean, it just I over went, there, just I in, went in inside the, the weeds. Yep. That's what I got. That's what, there's what Andrew got. Yeah, I see it. There's a cast. Daddy, get this. Get his weed off. Mm. Can Daddy, get his feet off. See, there's nails sticking out of this. You gotta watch out when you walk. I was shouting about fish and running for nets, so now the next our neighbor's out trying his hand off his dock. 
What a beautiful night. You saw a little thing jump. Jump was probably one of those tiny fishes.